Alright guys, we're going to talk about the data links. When you, underneath your cab, these are diagnostic links. You can see uh, somebody already has, I guess, something plugged in here already. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, somebody's already has something tied in. Um, their own onboard stuff. Uh, which, this is only made to do a diagnostics. It's a, I think it's a J19, I can't remember, J19, 28. I could be, I could be wrong on this. It's, it's supposed to be 500, 500K and the speed of this line. And this communicates with all your onboard computers, which there's a lot of them, a lot of onboard computers. And then when you plug stuff in here, it, it interferes with the flow uh, of those computers. And it actually give you faults. I've seen them give them faults and mess with it. And it can actually mess up you, somebody troubleshooting something. Uh, it can actually mess up that too. So when you're even troubleshooting, when you, First thing they want you to do is take disconnect everything that's on this line because uh, it can interfere with uh, diagnostics. If you're doing diagnostic, make sure you disconnect any of this stuff anyways. But if you're just a truck driver, you do not want to, it's not recommended to put your any of your GPS or monitoring devices um, off this uh, uh, diagnostic J1925 that you're supposed to uh, tap into and it's a lower speed it's a 250k i think and i'm going to show you that right now actually guys uh the place that they have is way better you don't want all those pl plugs by your feet anyways i don't uh, i've seen horrible messes and cheap ways people just have wires hanging down over there on the bottom corner over there so uh there's a way easier way to plug this stuff in it's actually designed so you can have a better access to it um when you have i know a lot of people put like whatever computer systems people have they'll put them in here they have cutout points for you and there's a panel there you can take off you can you can do anything you need but to put drill a hole in the panel here or whatever you need to uh any monitor device or mapping or uh, qualcomms or uh, gps devices that a lot of them need this because it monitors computer to get them how you're when you stop how fast you're going um, it's not a recommended idea to plug it into this because it messes with all these on-bar computers, which um, there's numerous of them. There is, you have headlight modules, <laughs> two computers for headlight modules. Each door has its own module and uh, it's it just like so many modules now. And that, and that all those modules just um, communicate in one line, this J19. I think it's J19, 1928. I could be wrong. I can't remember the last two numbers. But they have another one for your, that gets the same information that is slower and it's uh, for adding on your extra stuff. So it's over, pull this panel off. All right. And there's your air filter for your cat too. Um, as you can see right down there, it's easy tapping point. So easy to get to, it's right there. You can hide whatever you have. Uh, as you can see, it's black. It's a lower speed, and it's for any of your modules that you need to plug, plug into. Not modules, your Qualcomm, GPS, or any monitoring devices you need that you need to plug into this 9-pin uh, data link to get your information to draw for whatever you need. Um, it's for a lower speed, and, doesn't, and it doesn't interfere with your modules down here uh, as much. I'm not sure, but that's what it's for. These, this is why this is here. So, and it's easier to um, mount your stuff and you can drill holes and it's right behind there and you can hide it and make it look better. It doesn't look all sloppy by your feet. It's like wires hanging around it may interfere with you. It's just way better, it looks nicer, um, the computers. So um, this is where the you should tap in for any of your um, add-on devices. All right, guys, uh, thanks for watching Big Rick Fix and uh, Stay tuned for any videos that come out and I might be doing some different videos, branching out for different things or anything that's informative um, down the road and anything down below, please like, subscribe and notifications or anything you guys like to see, um, just let me know and bye guys, bye, later.